welcome to episode 16 of Metric Mates. It is a pleasure to be back. Um, and today we have the privilege of being joined by our first female guest. All female. It's our first female guest. The rest of them have all just been blokes. So it's, <laughs> uh, it's a pleasure to have you, Kate. How are you? I'm okay, thank you. How yeah. are you guys? It was said with such enthusiasm. I feel I'm like... so happy. <laughs> <laughs> Um, I'm glad to hear that you're doing all right though. Strafe, Rob, usual lot. Are you both all right? Doing all right, yeah. Just chilling. Right. Yeah. 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 So before we get started, obviously we need to have a wee chat to to old Kate up on up in the top top uh, left, I think you're on my screen. Um yeah. tell us a bit about yourself, Kate. Give us a bit of an introduction. Tell us tell us what the crack is. Um I am a new Twitch streamer. Um, nude. No, new, you dickhead. Oh, new. Sorry, new I don't think you said nude. <laughs> <laughs> can I... Can I, I this episode's going to go already. <laughs> no, I started streaming in October um, and grew pretty quickly and I've made a lot of new friends very, very quickly, such as yourself, Ashley. Not you two, but... <laughs> Um. Yeah, I like to play games and have people watch me. So, which is why a lot of us, I suppose, do it. I guess. Um. But we'll get a little bit more into Twitch and stuff in a in a little while. Obviously, this isn't your first experience of being podcasted. No, it's not. I believe Adzi was um the virginity taker of that kind of. Is that the wrong thing to say? Yeah, potentially. Yeah. I don't think it's that weird to say. You were you previously a podcast virgin before this before Adsies? I had never done a podcast before. So I'd there you go then. No, it's Kylie not weird. weird. Exactly the way he's exactly all looking at me makes it seem like it's weird. It's just it's it's really weird. Okay, can you say exactly what Ashley said? No. <laughs> oh yeah. fuck yes! I, you know what I meant. You know what I meant. Anyway, yeah. So as you mentioned, you are um, our first female guest how do you feel about being surrounded by well strafe more than anything he was not not in anything but check out his hair since he came on the <laughs> camera got a new trim strafe have you yes is that a fresh trim Ooh, i'd like to hope that he'd done it all for the episode but i don't think that he has <laughs> okay. i shave actually about 20 minutes ago bloody bloody about 20 minutes ago hmm. wow you missed a bit kid yeah. I've got a very young face, so forget you, rid of you, that. I you go. do have a young face. That's when I start getting ID for Red Bulls and Cokes. <laughs> oh, that's a fun game, actually. Kate, how old are we all? I don't know. Don't Come on, we're face. putting you in the pressure pressure seat. Well, Rob's just sat in the fucking dark. There. Yeah, you can have oh, yeah, see, Rob. I can't even see I, it was um, I seem to remember you saying you're all 30 something, aren't you? That would be correct, actually. Something. Yeah. That's all I'm looking for. I don't know. I'm not very good with ages. How old so am I? You are 20... 49. 26. 20, 20, 26. That's what I was going to say. Is that right? <laughs> yeah. We can get in. Um, Rob's 39. Strafe's 36, what? and I'm... What are you talking about, bro? <laughs> <laughs> uh, no, I'm 30, Rob's 31, and Strafe is also 3-0. So we're only kind of new to the 30s. We'll still act like we're 22, but alas. That was a, that was a, a very surprise segment that I didn't really expect to put in, but here we are. <laughs> might do it in the future. Um, so as you might have seen from other episodes, we start off every episode by doing a drip check. Have oh. you seen what are you? What, okay, I've already started. <laughs> wait, wait, what are you wearing, Kate? What are you wearing, Kate? <laughs> I say this every week. It's not just now. Are you wearing? Um, it, it's it's really excited? boring. This is just Primark. It's really boring. Primark. Strafe. I um, upon an adventure, I found this jumper, oh, which yeah. was in my drawers. You know, last week I had. Jumper from the drawers. Yeah. I've got another one now. Jumper from the drawers that I feel have existed. Right. And then together with that, I've got... Oh, 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 oh. Oh, oh. Jesus! Oh, be careful. <laughs> Can nearly see up there. 
Oh, ah, you're there, Dan. It's almost a ball back there. They were, they were... <laughs> They're not big enough to be seen. Don't worry. <laughs> Rob, please tell me you're wearing your Mexican shirt. I am, actually. How did you know? <gasps> wearing the old... You get in. The old Mexican top. You love oh, shirt. yeah. We love that shirt. It is good to be fair. It's like episode... That's you know, a good shirt. That's a good shirt. Ten times, actually. Bound to get it right one time. Is what? You say it enough times, you're bound to get it right one time. Exactly. But I don't think you've worn it since like episode one. So it's nice to have yeah, a I've not worn it for a while. What are you wearing, Ashley? I am wearing. What top are you bragging? My Ooh. United shirt. Because I was just sat watching the football, um, which was abysmal as usual. Um, Painful. But I just Painful. fancied the green today. I was just feeling a bit feeling a bit jazzy. So I thought, oh, I'll go for the green one. Yeah. Have you got other ones? Yeah. Have I got other ones? Yeah, Man United ones. Yeah, I've got like fucking 10. I just. They're just so comfy. I don't know if people just sit and wear football shirts. They're comfiest things ever because you just like they, they're just they're just comfy. It's just a t-shirt. No, they're not though. They have like different like. Do you know what I mean? No, glow in the dark, and that they glow in the dark. <laughs> <laughs> um, cool. So green hoodie, Mexican t-shirt, old jumper just found, and a glow in the dark United shirt. We are. The height of fashion. Dripping. Uh, we are dripping in drip, as the kids would say. I feel like at our age, we can't say that stuff anymore, Dan. I don't think it's. No, so I don't right. think you can. <laughs> you're, you're older than the two of us. What do you mean? I don't think you can. I'm not saying that, am I? No, okay. <laughs> you, you described my gravy as mid earlier. Listen, right. Yeah, that's true. Context, right? Kate. You had a, like a, a, not KFC, but you had chicken from a takeaway before you came on, right? Yeah. Listen in the group chat. And the gravy was the, the gravy was made. dirtiest, but... wateriest thing you'll ever see. Oh, like pond water. Yeah. <laughs> it did look a bit like that. Tasty though. Tasty though. Like with gravy, it's got to be thick. It's got to be thick gravy, otherwise don't chat. You know what's worse about that, right, is we, um, Jay forgot to add it to the order, so we had to add it separately on Deliveroo, add it as a collection, and then ring them and say, can you put it in the bag? Oh, just to get you off, off a fucking pond gravy. Yeah. <laughs> but it tasted That's nice probably thing. why they give you pond water. <laughs> it, was, uh, it was like jelly that had been microwaved or whatever. So it tasted nice. Uh, it's a bit of liquid jelly. You know, you know jelly. jelly. Um, yeah, it, it sounds yummy. <laughs> it, it tasted good. That's all that matters. <laughs> we'll go again. Okay. Hello again. Um, you might not be distracted and typing in the Discord or something while you're in the middle of an interview because that's very rude. I'm not. Yeah. I've just literally just seen your keyboard in a way. Yeah, see? <laughs> I'll just sit like this the whole time. <laughs> um, how have you found your stream journey so far? Are you enjoying it? Yeah, yeah. I yeah. got the stream like bug very quickly mm. and um, streamed seven days in a row from the first day I started, which was fun. Yeah. Um, and actually got affiliate in that week. Oh yeah, that was quick. So, have I gone, or have you guys gone? Oh, you've gone. You've gone home. I can still hear you then. You just look very dejected. No. I don't think you said actually. Probably when you asked about streaming, you know. With what? When you asked her about streaming with Jenny, it's probably... Streaming? What? <laughs> you kind of lost your decorum, actually, I think. Yeah. You? Yeah. <laughs> what are you even chatting about? We're going to have to try and invite him back in, aren't we? Right. What are you, what are you writing, Dan? His love letter. Yeah. Yeah. No, I'm just, I'm just being, I don't actually. I need to go back to work and do some something. If more you love it. Yeah. I'm losing my fucking marbles. Feeling a little bit kind of out of sorts. Out of sorts. Yeah, I know what you mean. I yeah. get like that sometimes, to be fair. Um, oh, there's a message. Bear with. Can we just stop recording, man? Yeah. I got the stream bug very quickly. Um, streamed seven days in a row. Um and got affiliate in that week. Nice. 
exciting and because I didn't expect it to take off as quickly as it did. Mm. Um, but yeah, uh, I think it's really easy to get the stream bug, isn't it? Like, yeah, absolutely, yeah. absolutely. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I'm um I'm coming up to my two year affiliate anniversary. Oh, wow. uh, yeah, I think it's at the end of the month, so I'm gonna have to do some sort of stream for it. Um, maybe just not many shots this time because I've been ruining my life recently. Um, <laughs> but yeah, I I kind of was similar to you. I like I started it and then I just automatically was just like I just want to keep doing it like all the time. Yeah. So I streamed yeah. consistently for ages and then I hit affiliate really quickly and then I just like a couple of months went by and I was just smashing it consistently. But then I just completely burnt myself out. And I was like, I'm so sick of streaming that I just I think, kind of yeah yeah. I think I took, I'm at that point now. Yeah, exactly. Like I took some time yeah. off, and I was just like, I'm so sick of doing it all the time because it doesn't seem like it's a lot of effort, but it's actually a fucking ball ache sometimes to stream because yeah, like it might just seem oh, you just put a camera on, you put a mic on, you play some games, but actually it's just like you know sometimes you just don't have the energy to because no one wants to sit and watch a fucking miserable streamer. Do you know what I mean? I mean, some people profit off it. And some yeah. people they'll probably make good money off it, but for me, I wouldn't want to sit and watch someone that's like, "Oh, fucking can't be asked today. I'm not doing it." I'd just be like, well, "I'm not going to stream then." Do you know what I mean? Yeah, like, yeah. That's the thing. You just, I just cancel stream. If I if I don't want to do it, then I'll literally just cancel stream. But um, that's the issue at the start is that you feel that pressure that you can't cancel stuff. Have to do it. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And you also feel like if uh, if your streamer friends have supported you. You've got to go in and support them. You have to go and support them. So, like, if you're not streaming, you're watching or you're tabbing up. Like, I've got one, two, three, four, five, five people tabbed up right now. <laughs> um, just because, not because I feel I have to, because they've made me feel like that. But, but, but now it's a case I want to. But like before, it was like I have to be there. I need to yeah. <laughs> donate, blah, blah blah, and all this. But it's not that, is it really? Um, I mean, everyone's when you first the, started um, out. It kind of feels a bit like a numbers game. Like yeah. you have to yeah, be I'm, with yeah. people all the time and around people and in streams all of the time. So it's yeah, just like very much still on the numbers game as well. Yeah. Um I've recently started just turning off my view count because oh, I turned it off, yeah, a long time ago. Yeah, yeah I didn't and realize I so, it would bother yeah. me. Yeah. Weird. I was so persistently watching all the time, like then I was like, oh, why have like five people stopped watching me? What have I done? Yeah, yeah, I like, yeah. yeah. It's like you do something, then the, your view account drops, you're like should I not have done that? Like exactly. But it's should like... ring straight from Rob back into the conversation. <laughs> How's she staring at Rob? <laughs> I've, been staring. I've been hiding, I've been like putting a window over Dan because he started laughing. <laughs> and I was gonna like be set off as well. Um so we kind of spoke obviously spoke a little bit about that, but like there's obviously a lot of things to like and dislike about streaming, but I guess we could open it up this little bit and say from your perspective, straight from Rob, obviously you both mob my channel as well, um, to some degree. Um, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um, is there anything that you like and dislike about me personally streaming? Do you think my kind sometimes. of... <laughs> yeah, sometimes there's like, you know, because you can't talk to you normally, I don't think. And sometimes, right. you know, if we want to just chat to you normally about something. It's hard to do that. want the world to know. Yeah. <laughs> and then I guess the other thing would be you know, when someone pops in the chat, sometimes you yeah, prioritise them. <laughs> so no. we'll be talking about like <laughs> melons or something, and then you'll be like, "Oh, hi, Jeff. How's it going, <laughs> Jeff?" <laughs> so, are there any positives to me streaming for you guys or not? <laughs> uh, none at all. <laughs> Come on, Dad. So, um... <laughs> yeah, they're awesome. Yeah, it can be quite fun. It can be fun to watch you as well. Sometimes. It can be fun to watch you sometimes. Oh, do you know, <laughs> this is why this is why I introduce Compliment City every week now because I just love watching these two squirm trying to figure stuff out to say. Um, <laughs> well, I've, I've I've helped you be introduced to lovely people like Kate and like Adzi and you know other people that we've had on the podcast. So that's a positive, I suppose. <laughs> yeah, yeah, for sure. Fuck. Yeah, yeah. Um, yeah. Uh, God, it's difficult, isn't it? <laughs> um, I thought Dan you... was going to go. Yeah. Well, I didn't expect Rob just to open a fucking can of fire. Like, don't like this, don't like this. Don't <laughs> Two like this. years of things that he's just been building up. Exactly. <laughs> I've got a well, list. little things. <laughs> they don't really bug me that much. Just tiny little things. Just, just, just every time. 
But like, I, every, just, every I did used to stream like all of the time, so I kind of get that because like when I used to stream all the time, because I like to make a point of like having a couple of nights off so we can just chill and play, and you know, there's not that extra pressure of me streaming. So when I first started, I was streaming like five days a week, so I can imagine it was quite frustrating for you to, you know, just finish work, just kind of want to chill, and there's me can entertaining Welcome whoever. To Jeff. Like, speaking of Jeff, Welcome you know. <laughs> Um, but what about you, Kate? Is there anything you don't like about this side of things, like Twitch uh, in general? The drama that comes with it sometimes. I'm not going to go into any details about anything. But um, no, I can't. But please, 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 please. I feel like you can. <laughs> I can't. No, genuinely, I can't. It's there's just been a few different things that have happened in, in like throughout my streams and like my friends' streams because I mod for quite a few people, right? So yeah. you have to deal with a lot of drama, and it's it's well, it's quite fun being involved and knowing, but also it's not fun when it actually stresses you out, and that's something that me and Adsy discussed as well. We discuss it quite often. Um, yeah. The drama of Twitch is just wild; like it's just wild. It is. So, yeah. Yeah, I mean, I've never really... I've occasionally had drama, but I've never really had any, like, serious drama or anything. Like, I've had um, people who... You've got amazing mods. i got what? Amazing mods. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I'm like, an amazing, amazing mod. Yeah. yeah. Um, I've had someone actively say that they don't fucking like me and that they don't want me to, they don't want me to come in their streams ever again, um, which was not particularly pleasant at the start of my stream journey. Um, but it is what it is. I guess that's just some people like people and don't like people. Um, Rob's disappeared, and I'll give you the context as to the reason why. I'm not going to give the whole story um, because it seems to be every time we do these podcasts and do these recordings, someone puts something foul and ungodly in the group chat, and I have to pretend like I haven't just seen it. But what um, I said wasn't foul and ungodly. I, mean, I, was just about, I was just thinking, why is Rob gone? Why is Strafe laughing? I was like, something's happening. Yeah. Rob's gone because I'm laughing and he was laughing. Exactly. Was because of what was put in the chat. No, There's nothing in the chat. Don't even chat shit. Sure. You're the fucking worst actor. Leak, 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 leak. No, I'll leak our drama. That's the only way it's going to go. Um, well, then there we go. Our lips are sealed. I think we have to leak something now. She mentioned last, last yeah, episode. Yeah, you said last time something. there'd be a leak a week. I don't know if we said a leak a week. week. I quite like that. Yeah. Right, well, Mention then. leaks. Come on then, Rob. Leak something. Well, I don't know. Over to you, Dan. I think you put something in this <laughs> in the jelly, didn't you? Yeah, that's what I don't want leaking. Uh, ah. Yeah, that's what we're not going to leak because it's, it's a little it's bit too much for the internet to handle, I think. So yeah. we'll... We'll keep it. We'll keep it under wraps for now. Um, oh, do you want to leak your drama, Shite? No. no, no, no. You don't. So there you go. Obviously, we haven't even talked about the fact that you're from Yorkshire. Yes. Yeah. So you're originally from York. York originally, but you don't yeah. live in York anymore, do you? No. I'm not you going to dox you to give me your full address and postcode or anything like that. Um, uh, my, <laughs> my <laughs> address is. <laughs> um, no, I moved up to Darlow last year. Uh, I've never been Darlow. Yeah. Uh, Shit. No. Oh, all right. I've, I've had to go like, a few times at work because there's an office there, and it's it's just like I don't know. It's just there's nothing there's nothing going for it, you know. There's nothing. Yeah. It's the, just very uh, great. The council building looks like. It, it, like, it's just made out of concrete, the whole thing. So it's like concrete panels. Nice. That'll do. Nice. It's awful. <laughs> <laughs> there are some, well, no, there's some nice cafes, but like, that's it. <laughs> but like, you wouldn't be running to go and visit Darlington for a day out. No. 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 God, no. <laughs> <laughs> there is a Tim Hortons here, though, which I do like. I've never had a Tim Hortons. What is it? Yeah, what is it's, it? It's like, it's. It's a uh, Canadian, like, excuse me, like Canadian McDonald's, I like to describe it, with donuts. Ooh. Ooh, yeah. So the nice. donuts are unreal. Like, the donuts are so good. Ask any Canadian if they like Tim Hortons and... I'll, I'm all over it. I'll have a little look. Um, 
So as we are at the start of the year, we're, we're kind of the start of the year, and what are we on now, the 14th, 15th, um, do you have any kind of hopes and aspirations for the year to come, Kate? Do you want to have achieved anything by 2025? On Twitter in general? Everything. Everything. Want, what, what are want... your hopes and dreams in life, Kate? Well, they, they were gone years ago. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, I want 500 followers on Twitch. Um, Which is definitely doable. Yeah, hopefully. Um, I also want to move into my own place again because circumstances have led me to move back in with my parents, hence the move up to Darlow. Okay. So I want to move out again. I'm trapped. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> what about you guys? What are your hopes and dreams for this year? Um, well, we discussed previously, well, I mean, we discussed, I set um done something of a challenge in that if we do hit that 100 subscribers before september yeah. he's promised he'll do an episode live in Hull city center which will just be the best thing ever yeah well, i work deep. near hull i work near hull just just throwing that out there just, like, you know. <laughs> just come in for a little cameo at some point yeah, I will. <laughs> um yeah his um his disdain for that part of the world is enough for me to want to set this the, challenge oh, the rant about hull oh I was <laughs> laughing so hard. Well, he's never been. He never will plan to go, but I don't know why. Uh, why is it just Hull? I've been Hull. I've been, been Hull. Have, have, you, been, have you been to Hull or have you been to the deep? I've been to the deep. So you haven't <laughs> been to Hull. Well, I think it was when I was, I'm pretty sure it was when I was a kid. Well, it will have been because I can't remember. Um, but I think we went on like public transport somehow. I vaguely remember so I wasn't we didn't go straight to the deep, we were somewhere else first in Hull. And I remember just being stood there and there was like a bin and then fucking fifty rats and shit. And it was like a main street and I was just like oh. There's rats in like, Darlow as well, just so you there know. There was rats everywhere, but fuck all man. Right. Well, petition, please push this as much as you possibly can. Get it's also work can, it's kind of work related, but not really. Um but yeah. Not really, um, I think Hull um, before. But yeah, just fuck all. Hey Con. You hate yeah, K-Con. fuck KCOM. Yeah. yeah, fuck KCOM. <laughs> fuck KCOM. KCOM don't help. <laughs> and that, oh, yes. that, that's what it is. It's KCOM, right? KCOM, like, I don't like Hull anyway, but KCOM are the 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 straw that broke the camel's back because, like, <laughs> who the fuck do Hull think they are to have their own internet provider for their own little town, city, whatever? <laughs> like, who do they think they are? They're not fucking Scotland. And you have to have it as well. You can't have any. Yeah, you have to have it. Like, just fuck off. Yeah, really? Yeah. Yes, I hate them. It's just shit. Yeah, if, you're, if you're a resident of the you can't have any of them. You have to have KCOM, yeah. That's what I mean. Who do they think they are? Yeah, my friend lives in Hull and she was like, I struggle so much to work from home because my broadband is shite because I have to use KCOM. I was like, oh, mate. <laughs> Oh my god! So if you go into like a phone shop or a broadband shop, will they only serve you cake on? They won't serve you like no, they can't. They can't like people who I know that work in companies can't sell it. They just don't sell it. They're not targeted for it. Fucking hell! Yeah, I'm like bloody hell! You could tell we're all past the age of nineteen if we're all very stressed about the fact that all can only have. One internet provider. It's just like the thing that the Vatican City or something like they're in little place. It's fucking shit up. I don't want to go there. I don't want your internet. Like to make it sound like I don't know. I think it's somewhere really nice. Like I don't know. I can't think of anywhere nice right now. To be honest, he's just got a hole on the brain. Yeah. <laughs> Everything's shit. <laughs> well, yeah. Anyway, that's one of our hopes is to to have that. September whole episode, which will be awesome. Um, I would obviously like us to continue to grow because um, we're we're at a steady rate at the moment. I need to figure out the YouTube short algorithm because it keeps monumentally fucking me up the ass every time I try and put some up. My so, uh, my barber subscribed the other day. Who did? My barber. Yeah. Yesterday, I think. Um, for context, I put a short up the other day that got eighty views, and I put a short up about three days before, at the same time. Same everything. They've got ten thousand views, so I'm just like, I don't know where. The, I've started doing this again with my hands every fucking episode. I'm always doing something. I think I think the key to things like this is consistency. So <laughs> just keep doing it. Just keep doing it. <laughs> um, yeah. So I need to figure that out. 
that gave us a big boost in the old subscribers um, when we were very popular with the shorts. So hopefully that can go. Um, we are going to do the Biscuit World Cup, not the Biscuit World Cup, the Biscuit Champions League is coming soon. The Chocolate Bar Champions League. Stop chocolate, biscuits. Bar. chocolate bar, that's it. We're not doing biscuit anymore. It's chocolate bar Champions League. Bloody hell. Chocolate bar Champions League. There you go. That's what we're gonna do. Dan's already made a spreadsheet, apparently. So uh, we're we're on the way. Um, the finished. I need to yeah, I was gonna say well <laughs> I'm not holding back. You can go ahead and organise whatever you need to organise, but I'd like to see the list. If that's yeah, it. Okay. Yeah, okay. Yeah. Just so I can know. Make suggestions. There's no suggestions. It's all the, cro- no. all the chocolate bars. What do you mean it's all the chocolate bars? How many? Do you know what I take? It's like 32 chocolate bars. Yeah, but you've obviously... Can you name more than 32? No, you can't. There's a sugar tip 32. Right, well, I need to see this list because I bet you... I sent you the like... list already. You it sent me a bad spreadsheet. No, I was fucking tossing. Have Honestly. you got lion bars on there? Yes. Yeah, they're on there. bounty on there. Don't, don't, don't start saying words. I've already there. got in there. There's 32 What about got them Milka? All. Yes. <laughs> yes. <laughs> yeah, Curly Whirlies are on there. Curly yeah. Whirlies. <laughs> Curly Whirlies. Curly Whirlies. What about. Yeah, um... got them. <laughs> what about Twix? <laughs> about what? Twix. Yeah, got fucking Twix, believe it or not. Okay. What about Caramac? Ooh. Listen, look, look at all of them. What a lot. <laughs> Don't, see, that's your leak for the week. We've just leaked 32. 32 chocolate, chocolate bars. bars. You can't just keep telling me one. It's like, oh, I bet he's not thought of Mars, but... <laughs> what about all the different variations of dairy milk? I've got um, I've got fruit and nut. What about normal? Yeah. I think so. I wouldn't have expected that to be on the list, actually. What about the Oreo dairy milk? Yeah, that's there. No, it's not. Oh, Yorkie and Yorkie Nut for Girls. Oh, no, no. Which one is it? <laughs> no, it's, it's not Have you seen that one? Girls. It's the fruit one, the fruit and biscuit one. <laughs> the purple uh, one. Oh, yeah, yeah, sorry. Yeah. I, was just, I was just asking Dan if he's got the... I've got the Nut for Girls one. The Yorkie. Yeah. Have you got the for girls one as well? No, no, it's the one that's the design for girls. Yeah. Surely no. that no. can't be a thing anymore. No, it's just... there's not. It's not a thing there anymore. Is. It's not oh, a right. thing is anymore. it not a thing anymore? No. Okay, well, no, no, no. <laughs> it used to be, but it's not anymore because um, you know, equality tried to happen. I've got Yorkie, I've got regular Yorkie. That's right then. Let's move on from this because you're all ruining my day. You just... Have you got <laughs> white lion bars? <laughs> <laughs> We're over this now. Have you got white lion bars or not? No, I'm not on fucking white lion bars. Uh, every chocolate bar ever. But I, I need 32. I got 32. It was a stretch already to get 32. I don't need other obscure ones. Have you got the England fucking 1966 World Cup winning chocolate bar? No, I don't. <laughs> Have you got the woman's Euro, what are they fucking won chocolate bar? No, I don't. <laughs> I don't have the Olympics one either. Or right, understood. We, we, well, you asked us to move on and then you're the one that's carrying on waffling on about chocolate bars. Well, Kay fucking let me snap. <laughs> Just lost it. You've had enough. Um, right, on to the on to the fun part of the podcast. It is Crisp World Cup time. Uh, mm-hmm. We are going to do both semi-finals tonight. Uh, so the next episode will be the grand final of what has been a very long process. Um, <laughs> 17 full episodes it'll have taken to get to a deciding winner of the ultimate crisp of all time. But Disclaimer, Kate, before any more accusations come in, we didn't pick every crisp ever when we first started. So there may have been ones that might not have been on your list or may So the greatest crisp of all time could actually be one that wasn't picked. Yeah, but we don't need that negativity loophole in our lives at the minute. I'm just saying you've got a load of spicy crisps and I don't like spicy crisps. So so. for for context, would you have put any of these four in a semi-final of a World Cup? Probably the Chili Heat Wave Doritos. I don't like Chili Heat Wave. That's what you just said. <laughs> yeah. yeah, is Chili Heat Wave spicy? None of them are fucking spicy, bro. They're all just mild. <laughs> bro. Bro. 
<laughs> I'm getting bullied. <laughs> I mean, did you really expect anything less when you came on? To be honest, <laughs> I'm never coming back. Um, See right, done now, context down. for people who are maybe watching: we have Sensations Thai Sweet Chili. Um, for the American listeners, they are a Thai Sweet Chili flavor potato crisp. Technically a crisp, but there's been much debate about whether things are actually crisps along the way. The only um, crisps, really. What are they against? Are they against... Oh, are they against Doritos? I think they're against it's Chili Heatwave versus Monster Munch, no. Ah. So it's it's uh, What's It's versus them. What's It's, I could only saw off the giant versions. I'm terribly sorry, um, but they are the same. So, shove it. Um, really cheesy flavour, Corn Puffs. So, whether they can be described as crisps, corn puff. who knows? I would say that they're crisps, but and then the second semi-final, we've got Doritos Chili Heat Wave, a non-spicy chili-based crisp. Um which you wanna see what's exciting? My my um sensation were in clearance. <laughs> but they're still they still got like a two weeks date left on them, so I'm not sure what's going on there. How much cheese? My sensations were the festive ones. 83p. Oh, I, I had the festive ones last week. Well, I thought they might be the festive ones and they'd put them in the sale, but they're not. They're just the regular ones. Sorry, how big's your bag? Who? Your bag. Like, your bag of crisps. Strafe. Your. You can't say your. Say names. Me, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Normal small bag. Sorry, you paid 83 pence even on clearance for a small bag of... <laughs> Bro, Christopher, you've been mugged. You've been mugged. <laughs> so expensive, man. So why have you whinging for 17 episodes? Live in Harrogate, it's expensive. What was the um, original price on them? One pound fifteen. Yeah, bro. Oh. Tell you. Ah. See why. Uh, <laughs> uh, the lamp was certainly cost four pounds. Four pounds, really? One pound twenty-five. One pound twenty-five. Yeah. These were. Oh, these were like two pound. These were like two pound fifty, I think. Bossman crisps. Bossman prices. Yeah, these are part of a meal deal from cover. Of course. And yeah, the what's it? I can't remember how much they I love how, Rob, you just buy like giant <laughs> fucking 24 packs of all the crisps so you just know that you've got at least one of them. Well, yeah, what happens is is that I, I always leave it to like the last minute. So then I just go to Asda and then I look for like a small bag of Watsons or like a, a share bag and then I can only get like the 36 multi bag. <laughs> so I'm like, stuck with five, six bags of boxes. <laughs> For fuck's sake. Right. Shall we shall we start dilly dancing? Dilly da- oh god, I hate that. I'm never saying that again. Shall we start dilly dancing? Um yeah, let's go. Right, let's get into it. Also, just before we start, Kate, I love how your face felt like this entire episode has been like what has possessed me to get to this point to sit on this podcast with these dickheads and just <laughs> you've been selling the whole time like fucking hell man no i'm just, <laughs> I'm just starstruck that i'm here in real life oh that's kind don't make with the dance head mates. any bigger though because we don't need it what are you trying to say bro is it my fucking caved in watermelon shaped head you insulted me what at what point yeah. have you ever said you've got a caved in watermelon head when did that ever happen? <laughs> Not it's standing fine. shit for no reason. That's how I describe it. It's cool. All right, right, let's go. What are we eating? Chris, Chris, let's go. Sensations, what's its first semi final? I was about. Oh. <laughs> Sensations. We're in semis first. Right. I'm fucking full from that chicken as well, so this is going to be a... just a huge one. Yeah. Yeah, I don't like uh, sweet chilli sensations. No? You don't like them. Do I need to have a pen and a whiteboard or something? So no, I don't have that. Like... I've, got, I've got paper. I could do paper. Yeah, yeah paper's good. I need to find yeah. my yeah. way. I've lost it again. My, oh, um... Every week, why? Because I just I throw it down when I finish an episode and I lose it throughout the week. How, how can it... Like, if I put this down here, it'll be there next week. There you go. How are you losing it? <laughs> That's true. Actually. Know, Where are you putting? Why are you, putting, are you putting things to like to lose them? Do you have a hole in your basement? 
<laughs> right, can we eat some crisps, please? Yeah. I'm ready with that. Let's I'll get into it. Oh, look at them, Mark. Look at it. Probably cover my whole head with that. <laughs> I don't know if it's gone full. Well, they've been hitting the same. I think it's gone full. They're not hitting the same. No. <laughs> I mean, full disclaimer, I'm very, very hungover right now, so they're absolutely slapping for me in a minute. <laughs> hmm. Okay. All right. Let me find my whiteboard. Do I need to rate the different um No. I know you do like mouth feel. Mouth, mouth feel. <laughs> <laughs> That's from um, Brooklyn Nine Nine, mouth feel. When it boils right in the pieces. You attack it however you want, Kay. Okay. Okay. Well, you kind of do want, I'm not gonna stop you, but it's my thing, so don't try and sip it. <laughs> Oh my pen, god, the attitude on that. I asked if I needed to raise them, but I didn't ask for your attitude. Listen. What are you playing? W, Rob. Good. <laughs> 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 Where were we? We'll have to have another one now because I've forgotten what it tastes like. While you lot are messing around, do you want to have a quick ritual that I do every podcast? Yeah. Go on. I have to um, have some perfume and just spray it on myself. Not on myself, but like in the air, a bit on myself. I have to smell good, even though you can't smell me. But you've got to feel like you're, you know. I've got to feel a million dollars. Yeah. What do you think about look it? You look so handsome. Thank you. That's what I need. Yeah, especially if you knew, if you knew Kurt, you know, looking you very good. I've been trying to keep it flat, so like I had it flat all day today and yesterday with no product in it, and it does look good, but it doesn't look good on the um, the camera side too. I mean, I literally got my hair cut yesterday as well, and no one's mentioned a fucking thing. But I thought you did it from the picture yesterday. <laughs> I wasn't going to say anything there. Oh yeah, I thought yeah. your sides look shorter. Yeah. Oh yeah, I feel like that. Um, I'm ready. Can you still combobulate him? Yeah. <laughs> I'm all discombobulated at the moment. Please hold. Please hold. If we play some hold music, we've got some like humming we can do in the background. Do 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 do. Can we connect your call? Wait. I'm gonna rehydrate and then let's get it. Are you guys got your scores on the doors? Oh yeah. For the you, first semi final. Like so we... Yeah, first semi final scoring some more. One, two, three. No, oh, you can't even see my got my blur on. <laughs> oh, what a Ah! So we've got seven and a half from Rob. We've got eight point five from Strave because he's got a full tummy, and uh, we've got an eight from myself, which gives us. Fuck it, I don't know. I even turn my blur off. Oh, there we go. Can you see there it now? Go. Yeah. Is it... No, oh, it's a bit bright. Seven. Oh, hold on, hold on. Oh my god! Look at the effort. Fucking hell. <laughs> 
All that effort because I'm I see good. it. <laughs> <laughs> no great seven. to see now. Yeah, seven out of ten. So we had seven, seven point five, eight point five, and then eight. So fourteen plus the eight is twenty-two. Plus whatever 22. you put there. Eight point five. Thirty and a half. Is that right? Does that sound right, Rob? Listen. Um, <laughs> should we do it again? So what, what do we have? Seven and a half. Let's do it. Thirty and a half is what the score was. Just you do it weird. Like I'd add up the points first. Well, that probably makes sense, actually. Yeah. Anywho, thirty and a half is quite a score to beat. It's pretty high. But, but I think yeah, I there's four of us there, isn't there? Huh? There's four of us. Yeah, that's true. How what's it's going to be? How how what's it's going to make it to the fucking final, like? True love. <laughs> right. Let's get into it. What's it? They all smell really good. They're very comforting smell. I love what's it. Yeah. Mm. I, I didn't put the um, peg on them good enough. What? A bit stale then. A bit stale. Are you a cruncher or a melter? I'm a cruncher, I think. Yeah. You're a like, cruncher. I like the little... I like that it keeps on the side of the <laughs> What was that? Dan's oh, definitely a melter. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I like that what's it's give you, like, a second meal on, on, the, on your teeth and you just pick them out. Great. Right. <laughs> And then the next day as well. Well, and you've got a meal for the next day as well. Exactly. Late yeah. night, wake up in the morning, <laughs> breakfast. What's this? Okay. Oh my god! It literally says, "Are you a cruncher or a melon?" On the back of the pack. That's why I asked. Oh, I thought you were just being genius. <laughs> why did you not take credit for that? <laughs> I mean, oh, wait, does it? <laughs> okay. Oh, fucking idiot, man. Who? I literally wrote my score down and then just rubbed it off for no reason. <laughs> <laughs> Did you have a change of heart, maybe? No, it's the same score. No. So do you guys not like what's it then? I mean, we can't be that Very close good. to if we've let them get this far. This is true. But... It's just you about you're all like, oh, as if what's it? They're not going to make it to the final. I just wasn't <laughs> expecting them to get this far. I felt like they were, they were superior crisps that were fought a hard time, given really tough, tough opponents. So, what's it have kind of slid through kind of quite easily in the rounds that they've had? Well, yeah, this is it. It does depend on who they go against, doesn't it? Exactly. Right, I'm ready. Anyone else? Yeah, I've been ready for a while. Well, uh, let's get going then. <laughs> Why not? <laughs> Three, two, one. So we've got two eight, a seven, and an eight. Eight, sixteen, twenty-four. <gasps> They've fucking done it. No. Have they? They fucking no. eight, sixteen, twenty-four plus a seven is what? Thirty-one. Yeah. What did you have, Ash? Eight. Two eight, sixteen. There's two seven. There. Oh, is it? I don't know. Okay, you put down? No, an eight. Kate gave an eight, I gave an eight, you gave an eight, and Rob gave a seven. Did so you give eight, Dan? Yeah, thirty-one. So, by point five of a point, what's it have made it to the final of the fucking Chris World Cup? Wow. Actual fuck. <laughs> I love what's it. I love what's oh, that's it. That's very annoying. I have to buy another bag now because I can't eat them. <laughs> I I, do you know one. what? The fact that they've out they've outplayed sensations is baffling to me. 
Because I honestly thought, given what was left, Sensations were going to take it. <sighs> Fucking hell. Look at the drama the Quiz World Cup unfolds, look. It's just mental. It's just outrageous. Crazy. Right, so we have our first finalist. Really cheesy, what's it? <laughs> of all the crisps across all the categories that we've come across, our first finalist of the World Cup is what's it? I feel like we've done a disservice. You've been so de derogatory. All right, leave him alone. Yeah, I'm really angry as if you haven't contributed to them being in the I final. Yeah. <laughs> I know, but like, you know, I'm just a bit like, fucking hell. I didn't expect them to get where they did. Right. Are we starting Monster or Jodrito? Are you on? Are we starting Monster or Jodrito? Dorito. Dorito. <laughs> See, Dan, I think you're going to struggle again because you've eaten too much. And these are your favourite crisps. No, I can eat these. It was the what's it were just um, the really stale. You've got a big bag cake. I love these. So have you, Rob? There you go. Yeah, I've got a big bag as well. Look at that. That is the perfect Dorito, isn't it? That is the perfect Dorito. It's like... Oh, we have got a contender in the other side. <laughs> Hold on. No, mine are all raggy ones. Oh, another one. Look at that. That's the one. Come on, Rob. Yeah. Rob, got that giant bag. Oh, I've done it. It's my one. No, fuck off. Mine's well better. Mine's the best. I'm not competing. Mine are all awful. Hmm. Right, I'm ready whenever you guys are. I'm just colouring in. <laughs> you won't be able to see it otherwise. It's true. I was stuck in my teeth, mate. It's good, though. Hmm. Like a concoction of the last three crisps. Mm, yum. <laughs> Is it how, does it, what rank would you give it, Ash? Out of ten. What, the concoction? Yeah. Uh oh. I may just pick my teeth. Cheesy up. Doritos. <laughs> I'm, really not, I'm really not into this conversation. No? It's a bit, a bit gross. I mean, I'm only picking crisps out of my teeth. Everyone does it. Mm. I'm You've all just actively said that you did it a minute ago, so don't even give me no grief for it. Right. Scores on the doors. Three, two, one. Oh, we've got a 9.5, an 8.5, two 8.5s, and Kate's gone for a 9. Woo! Okay. 9, 9.5 is 18.5, plus my 8 is 26.5. Or I've gone for 5, so 27. Rob, did you put an 8? 8.5. 7 plus the 8. It's 35 and a half. 35 and a half. Bloody hell. Right. I think that's going to be tough to beat. I'm not going to lie to you. Well, we said this last time about Chili Heat Wave. Not Chili Heat We did. We Thai did. Our sensations. Right. Fucking what since? <laughs> All the crisps in all the world, and it's cheesy what's it's in the thing. <laughs> yeah, oh, well, I hope they win. <laughs> <laughs> right, 
Aye. A bit of an outsider, I think, but still a good contender, I think, Monster. Oh, my God. What is this? Wait. I've never had these before. You've never had wait. them? Wait, no. wait, hold up, hold up, hold up. Okay, hold up. Dan's got up. something to share, look. Why have you got a bag inside a bag? I've just obviously been saving them and then forget that I saved them, so I'll buy more. <laughs> for God's sake. <laughs> but I feel like my score for these is going to be a bit skewed because I spent my afternoon today walking around Darlington City Centre mm. trying to find these. I went oh. to seven different shops. Yeah, but you can't take away your score just based on how annoyed they made you. Yeah, but it's like accessibility. Are we you not know, That them? was never a factor that we brought into the... The other three, I just went to Sainsbury's and there they were, all next to each other as well, actually. <laughs> He should it's have like been able to eat the sweet fries and Tyrrell's cheese and onion. They were a nightmare to get hold of. The um, Seabrook beef ones as well. Yeah. Oh, they smell uh, scampi fries. <laughs> right. Let's get into it. Let's find our second finalist. Oh my god, <laughs> you read the back of this. Probably, yeah. What, the miniature it's... monsters with big crispy Miniature heads? monsters with big crispy heads or crunchy claws plucked straight from flaming hot beasts. Bite off each crispy toe, or is it an arm? Nibble the sides or stick your tongue through the hole. Oh my god. Let it melt in all the flaming right. hot glory. I really no. want this to be a thumbnail. Can we please put our tongue through the holes? No. I've already put mine in the back of the bag and fastened it. I'm, do, I'm doing it for mine anyway, so there you go. You've got to let go of it. No, I, I can't do that. Oh. Curl your tongue and put it in it. <laughs> well, right, I'm really glad you found someone, actually, because I don't think you will, you'll find someone again. So hold her tight. <laughs> 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 What was that? <laughs> What's that I'm a bit worried about it. <laughs> right. Are you still colouring in, Kate? Yeah. Okay. Colouring in, Kate. She's our friend. She eats crisps and then colours in. Good that. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, I'm ready. Literally, Kate's never coming back on this podcast ever. Like, yeah. <laughs> based on tonight's experience, you just like fuck that. <laughs> I hate it here. <laughs> right, we ready? Yeah. Three, two, one. Oh, oh. Oh, it's mixed. Look. Oh, okay, right. So we've got a fucking ten. I nearly went ten, you know, but I could. Don't think I could perfect score it. So we've got 10 and 9.5 is a 19 and a half plus the 8 is 26 and a half. 27 and a half. 27 and a half plus the 6. They've just fucking missed out, haven't they? Good. Right. <laughs> <laughs> Rob's huh? in the darkness. Good. I prefer them to Doritos. I prefer them to Doritos personally. I never thought I'd say that. I remember at the start when I thought Doritos were going to be my heroes. You thought the chili wave were going to go all the way. Well, they are still. still. Yeah, they are still. Remember, it's, it's the vote. The vote. The people. It is. We on. aren't. Um, we aren't allowing this just to be our decision. So during the week, we're going to put a poll out across various socials, and we're going to let people vote to figure out who they would like to be the ultimate crisp champion. 
and we're going to take that into consideration based on next week's scores. Um, but to confirm, it's finally coming to an end. Interesting. I always, whenever we have guests on stuff, I always wonder what they go back and reach for after we've done the World Cup. Interesting. Right. Monster man. It would have been a nine. Yeah. Had I not had to do seven different shops in Dallas today. <laughs> Well, it wouldn't have mattered anyway, I don't think, anyway, because Rob scored it so poorly that... Um, yeah, Rob, we... you fucking villain. <laughs> <laughs> Just Look sitting so it. mysteriously in the dark, yeah. like, six. And he's sat eating them still. <laughs> no, one's eating them as well. Oh, we'll get got... fucked then. No. <laughs> I bet he's got, like, a white cat on his lap that he's stroking. Yeah. <laughs> um, so, the decision is this. Doritos Chili Heat Wave. And what's it? Really cheesy. Are you finalists of the Quiz World Cup? Really? Yeah. Really? Like you've not been sire for the last 12, <laughs> 15 episodes. Really? Didn't see that coming. Really? These are your finalists, people. Soak them in. Drink them in. This is what you're going to be deciding on this week. What do we think? Outsiders perspective, K, what do you think is going to take it? Uh, Doritos. Do you think? Yeah. We will see. We will. I think. Leave. I think outsiders will judge like the. You know, like if you're near someone and they're eating what's it, you're like, that's grim. <laughs> no, no, don't, really don't think the same. Oh, I know what you mean. Yeah. It's like you wouldn't. You wouldn't go to work and sit at your desk or sit in a meeting with yeah. other people and crack open a bag of what's it, would you? That's okay. So that kind of brings us back to the question we used to ask that we don't really ask anymore. What would you pick up on a meal deal? What's it or chili eat with? Mm. I don't know. Neither really. I don't really go for. I'm really boring when it comes to crisps on a meal deal. Yeah, I go for spicy crisps. Go for. I go for salted. salted. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> no, you don't. Why Do you know what? This podcast, bro. Why uh, is it here? I get, get I get ribbed for it all the time. They're like, oh, "Okay, what have you got for your meal deal?" <laughs> Salt. I'm like, "Yeah." What what hey, sandwich you get? Fucking plain podcast, pan. Right. You you you're helping us decide the two finalists, and your favourite crisps are very salty. No. Have, <laughs> no, have, have sandwich, but it's salty crisps in a fucking bottle of water. I just like to go for no. <laughs> so, okay, what is or a sandwich? Milk. What sandwich do you go or for? Um, plain ham. I really tend to go for a sandwich. Okay. Or, if I do, it's like a, the chicken and bacon. Fair enough. You've redeemed yourself there. That's a banging sandwich, to be fair. And then do you like a monster, or are you more of a water gal? I'll get... No. Well, I always have a... Mo- <laughs> <laughs> no, I've always got monsters in my car. Right. I've got milk in my car. <laughs> <laughs> I'll get like a cherry Pepsi Max or something like that. Ah, Okay. Fair enough. Okay, that it kind of redeems it. It kind of redeems it. But also, I wish we we should have put you through the vetting process at the start. No, I just before. like a plain crisp to go with <laughs> a plain sandwich, all right? But you did score quite highly on some of the crisps, so I guess you could potentially change your crisp of choice in the future. Yeah, it's not that I dislike any of them. I just I just don't want them with my meal deal. I just want all plain, reliable, simple. You know? Yeah, yeah they are a reliable. Cri- did we do really solid? I think we did. No, we didn't. I think, I think we, we did, did, didn't we? Right, well, uh, right. You need to redo it, then. <laughs> no, I'm not redoing really this, ever. <laughs> I'm not doing it again. <laughs> to do this again. <laughs> what do you mean? It's Bro, been a riot. Ten million pounds I'd need for this. <laughs> ten million pounds? No, ten. Ten million pounds. <laughs> That's what I said. Ten million. Uh, right, so... Our deciders are Dorito Chili Heat Wave and What's It Really Cheesy. Uh, there'll be some polls and stuff going out to various platforms during the week, so keep an eye out for those. Um, obviously, a reminder, once this is over, we are starting the Chocolate Bar Champions League that we've spoken about. Um, maybe we had a... Oh, we could add maybe like a voting thing in that during the week, Dan, and be like, what What would you want to see in the Champions League? Or is that... Yeah, no, no, well. no, 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 no. We're already picking this. They're, they're going to be pre-selected chocolate bars, right? Okay. Can people vote to see what they like? We'll know what we're going to do for the episode before we do it. 
Okay. So next week we'll be doing these bars. What do you guys think? Okay. All right. Okay. I'll do it that way. Okay. No, what, Chris, what chocolate bar should we get next week? I don't it's think it's so bad idea. People watch it. Oh, it's not a <laughs> no, I wasn't thinking like every week. I was thinking like the first week. I wasn't planning oh. on doing it every week. But anyway. Um, yeah. So it's my <laughs> my favourite part of the week. It's Stan and Rob's most hated part of the week. It's uh, compliment city time. Um, so this has been a recent thing, and Kate, you're gonna have to get involved, Sam. I'm afraid. Um, over the last couple of weeks, I've very much put Strafe and Rob on the spot and asked them to not only compliment each other but to compliment me, and vice versa, until we get to an incredible awkwardness and we decide that we don't want to do this anymore. Um, well, I decided I, that like the first time you did it. You're so needy. <laughs> But we just, I, you know, it's not even that. I just, I love to watch you both squirm and think of stuff. It, it gives me great joy for you to both sit there and go, uh, I don't know. So, without further ado, Rob, say something. Hey, nice. yeah. About straight, did you say? Okay. Yeah, I already said his hair. Um, yeah. yeah, I think he's looking pretty, pretty dapper at the minute. Very, very, uh, fresh shaven. You know, free, yeah, fresh shaven. Yeah. You know, got a bit, bit of a fade going on there. Shorter okay. there, longer there. You know what I mean? Bloody it's hell. Pretty good. It's a discovery. Yeah, go on, Emma. You might as well knock them all out of the park while you're here. You go first. Um. Yeah, Ashley, yeah. You've also had a fresh trim, but I can't say that because you told me earlier. Um, yeah, you've got a very nice um, enthusiasm you bring to the group, which I really like. Thanks. <laughs> that makes you know makes everyone feel really good. I think. I'm yeah. I'm I'm glad that you enjoy my enthusiasm. Um, Kate, I'm going to put you on the spot now because I know you're back discording, so we're going to pull you back into um into the actual recording. Bring you back to the real world, Kate. Yes. Yeah. Hey, compliment us all. <laughs> no. Wait, Rob didn't say anything nice about no. Kate. Oh, do I have to compliment Kate as well? Oh, yeah, no. I have to. Uh, yeah, Kate, you've got a very nice voice. There you go. Oh, that's nice. See, see, sometimes nice, it does yeah. happen, and we do get nice things. You do have a very nice voice, Kate. <laughs> I would agree. No, You're up know. next, Dan, remember? Yeah, Dan, you're next, so... <laughs> <laughs> so this is a squirm that I love. It's great. Oh, I thought Kate was going... Well, that either, either, I'll tell you what, I'll go, shall I? Shall I mix it up and say I'll go? As long as you don't take my answers. Strafe, your fashion choices of late have been very good. Your, you not... Like, because we obviously, we obviously, see yeah, sure. <laughs> so, I mean, obviously, like from the kind of the, the waist up, the waist up, they've been, they've been it's very the classic work from home vibe, isn't it? It really is. It really is. Um, Rob. I told you how handsome you are before, so I'm not going to call you handsome again, um, as much as I know you like to hear it. Um, your desire to, even though this isn't particularly a comfortable environment for you, to continue to do these episodes is is great for me, I think. I love the fact that you're so like committed to the whole metric metric verse of it all. Um, and I feel like... So, I do feel like sometimes you don't want to do it, or it's not really... Hey. Awkward. Yeah. Well, I'm going to support you, aren't I? Exactly. That's what I mean. That's that's a nice thing. And obviously, I'm sure that you're loving your time here as well. Um... <laughs> <laughs> Do you know what? Kate doesn't get a compliment off me because she does nothing but sit on Discord all night. So, I'll, uh... I'm not. <laughs> that's it. I'm here. <laughs> well, Kate, what I'll say is that despite your poor crisp choice um, in terms of your meal deal options, um, you've you been just complimented it. Can I just say, dude, I didn't you compliment said, very solid. You said, it's, you said it's what did you say? It was it was like a reliable, reliable is a compliment, bro. It doesn't anyway. You've added a certain flavor to the episode, Kate, and I appreciate that very much. Not in like a way, why does it <laughs> come look at me weird when I say stuff like. You've had a certain character to the episode and it's been a pleasure. 
So thanks for having us on. And we hope that you'll return in the future. Um, by all means, that is your choice. <laughs> <laughs> we completely understand if you've gone, but no way, I'll rather just sit and watch them. Um, but yeah, it's Round been a pleasure. Glass. <laughs> huh? you have a chew glass. Strafe, talk, talk compliments to us. Roberts, <laughs> I you. love that your house is full of what's it? <laughs> That's not a compliment. <laughs> <laughs> Shit. <laughs> I love that you've invested so much into what's it? Okay, right. Next. Uh, Kate, I like your uh, ponytails while we are. Yeah. The hair. Flats. 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 Uh, Ashley. Uh... Oh, the aggression is unreal. <laughs> Jeez. I like that you've managed to keep your decor in this episode. As opposed to. <laughs> I don't know. There's not. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to do this every week. I'm doing this every week. It's great. Kate, we're putting you on the spot now. You can't. <laughs> right. Ash, I like that you are non profit with your streams. And I yes. like your lights. They're cool. Thanks. Um, Strafe, I like how much you wind Ash up. I think it's really funny. Um, oh. <laughs> Rob, I like how quiet you are. <laughs> <laughs> and you sat on me for the majority of this time. That's good, isn't it? I yeah. just sat there in the dark, like he sat there in the dark with his little cuppa, and he's just he's just watching. He's having a, he's he's having a time. <laughs> just here for the vibes. <laughs> <laughs> Matt, that's what I might have to call the episode. Just here for the vibes. But yeah, that was fun. That I, I really love. I, I love. That. I love, I love it that. when it's awkward. It's great. It's just so much fun. <laughs> Must be great to watch as well. You are? Must be great to watch as well, I bet. Yeah. Well, all of us just like... <laughs> <laughs> um, so we are coming towards the end of the episode. Uh, so, Kate, this is your opportunity to plug, to talk, to say nice things plug about yourself. yourself and people that you would recommend us checking out, etc. So if you want to have a minute to do so, then please do. Um, Look, your dad's finally streaming. My dad is streaming right now. That's what I was doing. I'm trying to. Oh, okay. Do you know what? You're forgiven right. then. You're completely right. forgiven. I've got his stream up right here in front of me. <laughs> um. So yeah, it's twitch.tv forward slash Kato with three O's and an underscore. Um, if you like, if yeah, if you like toxic gameplay, um, emoting, laughing, and really, really, really terrible attempts at accents. I don't yeah. know. I think your Australian is pretty good, like. Well, it's that's where the that's where the username came from was uh, the Australian accent. Oh, um, do it. Do it now. What should I say? Donation. So it won't. Um. Say. Um. Strafe, you have nice hair. Strafe, you have <laughs> nice hair. <laughs> hey, see, you're not so right. Good it. <laughs> <laughs> Look, he's gone already. He's blushing. <laughs> <laughs> um, streamers I recommend is Jinjana, Ben Shields, and Victoria Louise. The fact that I wasn't on top of that list makes me a bit sad, but it's, it's fine. It's your podcast. <laughs> Everyone knows that you stream. I'm joking. <laughs> Um, but yes, I do vouch for all of those. Um, I also follow them and enjoy their streams too. So uh, Victoria finally followed me. Well, she followed me on Instagram today, which I was surprised at. Because the first time she ever came into my channel was to talk directly at you. Didn't say hi or anything like that to me in my channel. Was just continuing a conversation she was clearly having with you a couple of minutes before. Yeah. So, so when, when she knows that I'm playing on people's streams, she'll come in and be like, oh my God, Kate's so pretty, right? And I'm like... <laughs> you got like a wing woman. Yeah. <laughs> any more for any more? Nothing no? for me. Straight from I'm in a work meeting. Nope, nothing from me, guys. <laughs> 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 well, 
You've got probably you've always got loads to import in promos. Oh yeah, yeah. I want to show um, asymmetric. Hey, you went right for the first Ace, time. Oh, sorry, Ace Remix, uh, <laughs> Papi Radio, and uh, <laughs> Kate's channel as well. Yeah. Uh, Triple O underscore. There you go. Strafe. Yeah, I just uh, yeah, just want to shout out on with Panther. Yeah. What? <laughs> yeah, just want to shout out all the um, all the girls and the boys and the men and the women of the world. Okay. Can I do one more shout out? Go for it. Um, the boss man at the premiere that had the monster munch. Big up boss man. We love boss men. To be fair, they always get the decent Christian. So big love. Strafe, we interrupted you. We do apologize. Oh, I don't know. Yeah, it's just trying shit, wasn't he? So. Yeah, don't, don't worry about, no, don't, don't worry about well, it. What, what were we even doing? Just shouting, giving promotions. Oh, be blown. Sorry, yeah. I want to promote myself. I've made it halfway through January. That's it. And uh, Kate's, well, I don't know. Kate, Kate's really good at streaming or something. <laughs> Kate, Kate, Kate O or something like that. I know. That's the one. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. Yep. Um, go watch her, I guess. Yeah, there you go. Well, don't be playing faces like that. <laughs> <laughs> um, Kate, it has been a bloody pleasure. I hope you've enjoyed it as much as your face suggests as it has. Um, hey. I'm joking. <laughs> um, we're into the final. Uh, I'm not going to push anything because I push the same stuff every week. But you know where to find me if you want to see me outside of podcasts. Um, I do have my other podcast and I also have Twitch, so I am actually promoting what I wanted to promote. I didn't even mean to. Um, Kate, it's been a bloody pleasure. You're a legend. And please go and check Kate's channel out. Please, 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 please. She's trying to get to 500, and I'm sure she'll have to just smash it soon. Um, if that's everything, then I'll call it here. Um, but until next time, take care. All the love. Peace. Okay. See you later. Bye-bye. Bye. Bye. It's so awkward. I'm going to keep going. Bye. Really awkward. Bye. 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 Strafe, move!